Hey y'all, now your girl at Sharifia all in one this. Come on, make we cook and chop a lot. On the menu today, we are going to be making buffalo wings, y'all. Yes, buffalo wings. Now, like I always say, if you are new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button right, right, right now. The notification bell. So every time I upload a video, you will be amongst the first to see it. To get started, we have our chicken wings for our seasoning, all peppers, flour, some salt, garlic powder, onion powder, black pepper, some sriracha hot sauce, some red hot hot sauce, some cayenne pepper, we have some honey for a little bit of sweet, vinegar, and butter. I'm going to start off by seasoning my chicken. We are not breading this chicken. Buffalo wings deserve to be eaten skin to sauce. No breading in between. So yes, we are just going to season our chicken, set it down for a good 30 minutes. You don't have to do that if you don't want to because the sauce is going to give it enough flavor. So after my chicken is well mixed in with the season, I am going to go ahead and start frying my my chicken. Once the chicken is in the oil, allow it to cook for a good five to seven minutes before you start moving it around. Now, my stove is on medium to high because I don't want it so high that it's going to burn before it cooks inside. Once you notice that the skins are starting to crisp up, you can now move it around, stirring occasionally to get the chicken to evenly brown on each side. We want nice golden brown chicken, just like so. So with this, it's pretty much done, but you can go a step further and get it nice and crunchy. So when it goes into your sauce and sucks up some of that juice, it will be crispy on the outside, but yet wet in the inside. As this comes out the oil, I am going to go ahead and fry the rest of my chicken. Then we are going to go into this buffalo sauce, guys. Let's get into this buffalo sauce, guys. I'm starting off with a stick of butter. I'm not gonna wait for my butter to fully melt for me to start adding my hot sauces. So now, I just added my red hot hot sauce, some sriracha hot sauce, my cayenne pepper powder, and I'm going to mix all of that in. Ooh, let me not forget, my honey goes in as well also and i'm going to take my time and mix all of that in making sure i have no lumps or bubbles in there 
Remember, the sriracha hot sauce and the red hot hot sauce are optional. You do not have to use those exact same hot sauces. You can use whichever one you prefer. That my sauce is all mixed in I am going to go ahead and add about a teaspoon of vinegar into my buffalo sauce now the vinegar is what gives it that acidic taste whenever you are eating buffalo wings now that my sauce is all mixed in, I am going to go ahead and marry my sauce and my chicken together. Once that is in, I am going to lower my heat and allow my sauce to slowly sink into my chicken. Mix that chicken in well. Make sure every inch of that chicken is coated into that mouth-watering sauce. Just like so, guys. We finish cuckoo. Come make we chop la. If you have made it far through this video and you have not hit that subscribe button yet, come on, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button right now, the notification bell, so you will be notified every time I upload mouth-watering videos just like this one. Mm -hmm.